Want to see more cool videos on our channel? We do, so press this bell and enable to send notifications. As Mother Earth carries us in her belly, she constantly experiences topsy-turvy changes and transformations. We can take the blame and think of our increasing human activities. Better still, we can shift the blame to the sun and its unexpected inconsistencies. As the calendar days pass us by, it's certain that the future will be marred with major chaos. These are 10 predictions of key events that the Earth will experience in the coming billion years. Number 10. New Ocean. 10 million years. As pastoralists graze cattle in the afar depression between the Ethiopia and Eritrea, they are oblivious that in another 10 million years, this arid and semaride area will be an ocean. The afar depression is by far one of the hottest places on Earth. The region is 100 meters below sea level. The distance between where the local communities reside and where the hot magma bubbles below is a mere 20 kilometers. More so, the tectonic movements continuously make the land thinner and distance shorter. It's like a war down under. From volcanoes, geysers, earthquakes, and toxic superheated water. In another 10 million years, all the geographical gymnastics will cease and only a dry basin will be left. It will fill up with water and form a new ocean. It will be the perfect getaway for jet skiing in the summertime. That wouldn't be too bad, would it? Number 9. Major Impact Event 100 Million Years The Marvel superheroes have predicted time and again the end of the Earth. Through IMAX screens, we have traversed space with Star Wars and Star Trek, allowing us a glimpse of the rocks that are floating around as if they have a score to settle with the planets. The prediction is that in another 100 million years, the reality is going to hit hard and the Earth will experience an impact event that's close to what's caused Cretaceous Paleogene to become extinct some 65 million years ago. It goes without saying that some hardcore species will survive. What seems to be certain is that the current generations of mammals will be destroyed, giving birth to a new era of superior species. It's mind-boggling to think that the kind of life form that will exist in the new Earth, something close to what we've seen in high-concept sci-fi. How would the Earth look like with super-intelligent invertebrates, reptiles, and amphibians living lives that should have been ours? That's something to think about. Allow your imagination to go wild. Number 8. Pangaea Ultima 250 million years Supremacy of the continents is set to start in the next 50 million years. It will require no effort from any sitting president or prime minister. Africa, which has been moving northwards for the past 40 million years, will start to merge into southern Europe. This will then cause the Mediterranean Sea to close up within another 100 million years. The shift from water to land will create in its wake thousands of miles of new mountainous environments, giving the mountain climbers new heights to explore. Australia and Antarctica won't be left out in the formation of a supercontinent and will start heading north to merge with Asia. As all of this is taking place, the Americas will take the westward route from Europe and Africa to create a union with Asia. After this mergers and acquisition, it is speculated that the Atlantic Ocean will grow and a subduction zone will form around the western border and bring the Atlantic seafloor down into the Earth. This will force the Americas to shift direction and go into the eastern border of the Eurasian supercontinent in 250 million years. If this fails to happen, the Americas will continue westwards, merge with Asia as according to plan. Eventually, if these turns and twists take effect, we will have a brand new hypercontinent, Pangaea Ultima. 500 million years after the last Pangaea that set the continental drifts as they stand today. Number 7. Gamma Ray Burst. 600 million years. Earth is like a ping pong ball that has borne the brunt of major impact events that occur after every several million years. Such are gamma ray bursts, which are streams of ultra high energy radiation coming from hypernovae. As we walk about going to the office, the coffee house, and the beach, we experience weak gamma ray bursts almost daily. That said, a burst from a nearby system that is 6,500 light years away can destroy anything in its line of fire. Gamma ray bursts have more energy than the sun will ever emit. These bursts can break the ozone layer into fragments and cause catastrophic climate change that would damage the ecology while causing extinction of species. Some believe the gamma ray bursts were responsible for the second historical mass extinction, Ordovician Silurian event, which happened 450 million years ago and wiped out 60% of all living things. Astronomy is pretty unpredictable, and it would be quite hard to give a date on when this would take place. 
It could be two billion years from now. Or a few million years from now if the starry Eta Carane explosion threat becomes a reality. Number 6. Uninhabitable, 1.5 million years. Maybe it's time galactic trips were available for all, so that we can know a lot more about our neighboring planets. As the sun scorches the Earth and grows larger in size, the Earth will no longer be a safe home. Being too close to the sun will cause all the existing life forms to die. The oceans will have since dried up, and only the deserts with burning soil will resemble anything we've ever known. There's a possibility that Earth could end up like Venus and become a wasteland of toxic poisonous metals. Luckily, Mars still might be habitable at this point, and will offer a sanctuary for any surviving humans. At this point, an odyssey into space will not just be tourism, lives will depend on it. Number 5. Disappearance of the Magnetic Field, 2.5 billion years You never think that a thing as simple as magnetism could be what stands between you and existence. Based on current findings and research, it's perceived that in 2.5 billion years, the Earth's core, which is liquid, will solidify into a solid block. In the process, the Earth's magnetic field will slowly depreciate into nothingness. This will mean that the Earth will have no protection from the harsh solar winds, and the ozone layer in the atmosphere will be easily eroded, making the Earth susceptible to further destruction. The Earth will be a shell of its former self, and end up like Venus due to the extreme effects of solar radiation. It will be no place to live and thrive. Number 4. The Inner Solar System Calamity, 3.5 Billion Years now here is where you pull up the image of the seven planets and see what borders Earth on each side. Know exactly who the enemies will be. In about 3.5 billion years, the orbit of Mercury might become long enough to cross the pathway of Venus. We are not entirely sure when it will happen. In case it does, here are a few options. There would be collision between Earth and other non-gaseous planets whose orbits will be unstable due to Mercury's little mishap. If the inner solar systems are not touched, it would take another 5 billion years for the orbit of Mars to cross that of Earth and create another possibility for a catastrophe. Either way, something will have to give. Number 3. New Night Sky, 4 Billion Years Depending on where you are on this currently green Earth, you can always get to see a sky full of countless stars. Many, many years ahead of this time, humans will get to witness the Andromeda galaxy grow massively in the nightly sky. It will be a picturesque sight of a spiral galaxy glowing in splendor up above in the heavens. It will only last for some time, then get distorted as it merges with the Milky Way and throw the stellar arena into disarray. The solar system might be discarded into an unknown hole. The chances of the two astronomical wonders colliding is, however, low. Number 2. Ring of Debris, 5 billion years. When was the last time you saw a full moon? Or a gibbous moon? The moon seems to be hiding nowadays. The moon becomes smaller each year. It goes further away from us and close to the sun by 4 centimeters. One day the sun will officially enter its red giant phase and the moon will never be seen again. If things really go bad, the force on the moon will cause a crash landing on Earth. At Roach Limit, the moon will start to break away as it defies the gravity holding the satellite together. These debris will form a ring around the entire Earth. This will be the case until the moon falls back away from Earth again after many millions of years. Another way this could go is, the Earth and moon exist amicably in the current orbits and move as they should. Then after 50 billion years, the Earth will enter a tidal lockdown with the moon. Then the moon's orbital height will decompose as the Earth's rotational power increases dangerously. This will go on until the moon reaches the roach limit and crumbles creating a ring around the Earth. Number 1. Destruction Unknown I know these predictions of doom and gloom are debatable, but truly the chances that our beloved Earth will be no more in the next dozen billion years is alarmingly high. It could be at the hands of a dangerous takeover planet or the sun with its glares and flares capable of drawing everything back to zero. It will be a sad day for any surviving humans to watch their birth planet be purged. For now, we can only hope that Earth remains intact and won't drift into the harsh realities. That said, once the multidimensional nature of quantum physics applies and black holes take over, survival will be out of the question. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoy the video, please let me know by clicking the like button. Do share, write a comment, and don't forget to subscribe so that you can catch up to my next video.